Criminal charges are now being filed against the Park City School District over alleged failure to report child abuse. The Summit County Attorney's Office says it's fearful there are more cases that were not reported. Fox 13 News reporter Emily Tenser joins us from Park City this evening. Emily. Kelly Bump, Summit County Attorney Margaret Olson is calling this a systemic and institutional failure by the Park City School District. There are three charges, each based on three different instances from October 2019, December 2021, and this month. According to court documents, in each case, employees with the school district were aware of rape or sexual abuse allegations, but investigations reveal there is no evidence that those allegations were reported to law enforcement or child protective services. Olson says the district was already subpoenaed and under investigation for failure to report the 2019 abuse allegation. Then the county's attorney's office found out last week of two more cases that were not reported to police. Once it became apparent that this was a systemic and institutional failure, I felt that uh, there was a high probability that there were other individuals um, other trusted adults who had reported only to the school and that the school had not properly reported that um, pursuant to law. She says there's a chance individual Park City School District employees may also face charges. Park City School District sent me a statement saying they just received the documents this morning and are still in the process of reviewing everything. Prosecutors want to remind everyone, especially school district employees, that state law says we are all mandatory reporters and that if you have reason to believe a child is subjected to abuse or neglect, you are mandated by law to report that to police. Now, the Summit County Attorney's Office says if there's any possibility that you have reported a case of child abuse or neglect to the Park City School District, there was a chance that that was not properly submitted to law enforcement. They're encouraging you to call Utah Child Protective Services or the Summit County Dispatch. You can find the numbers below on the screen. Reporting live in Summit County, Emily Tenser, Fox 13 News, Utah.